Sometimes an event actually triggers a lot of action. And in my case, it was the patient who came into my clinic, and that day he actually came in with his daughter because she was there to make him confess. Over the intervening months, he had actually developed a gambling problem. He was going to the casinos every day. He was gambling thousands, if not tens of thousands of dollars. What I realized was that he had an impulse control disorder, which is something that can happen as a consequence of Parkinson's disease and, importantly, the medication I was giving him. Just because we can't tell from clinical grounds alone who's gonna develop the side effect, that doesn't mean that we can never tell. We can use genetics. We can actually find a panel of genes that can separate out who's at high risk versus low risk. And then we can actually tailor drug choices according to their risk. Because we know there are one million people with Parkinson's disease. And we know that 20% of them are at risk for impulsivity. But with some tools like this, we can actually really decrease the number of people that we cause this complication in. And this is Precision Medicine at Penn.